Live with some Facebook questions and answers for the week. Hey, Doug. Yeah, a lot of people getting on Facebook this morning asking questions about their car. We're always here to help. Facebook.com slash the cars are. We were talking about it earlier. Auto loan delinquencies on the rise. In fact, in September, we saw late payments on auto loans throughout the country hitting new highs. That's not good news. If people are not able to pay their car loans, the ripple effect through the economy can be serious. In the U.S., more than $1 trillion. Think about it. One trillion dollars <laughs> is outstanding for auto loans right now. That's how much Americans owe on their cars. So what is the problem? Well, a couple things. One is that the average car loan is at an all-time high. When I used to buy cars, most people would finance it for 48 months. Well, in the 90s, that went to 60 months. Now, increasingly, people are setting the standard at 72 months. That's six years. Whoa. That's part of the problem. People have ebbs and flows in their uh, income and household income. 72 months, a six year loan, that car likely, in some cases, can be worn out by the time it's even paid off. That's a big contributing factor. One of the other factors is people increasingly are looking for cars with no down payment. That's problematic. It just makes your car payment even higher. You got to try to put something down on the car. Lastly, a big problem is leasing. Right now, leasing is accounting for 31% of all new car acquisitions. You guys know how I feel about leasing. Yep. Leasing is nothing more than a glorified rental. You put all that money in the car. In some cases, you put a down payment on the lease, and that money is completely gone at the end of the term. It's one of the worst financial mistakes people will make is leasing a car. And for those of you who are screaming at the television, oh, but there's a tax benefit. There's really not. The IRS got rid of that benefit about 25 years ago. Yikes. Rarely are you able to successfully and legally write off an automotive lease. Be careful with those lease options. Heck, if you're going to spend all that money, at least you want to have something to own at the end of the term. We're going to be putting more of these tips on our Facebook page. Let me bring you over to it. And I don't want to really, I know it's morning, you guys, uh -huh. and I hate to do this, but there's a picture of me on Facebook. Let me see, let me see. And um, this, it's, it's just weird. That's me on Monday morning while I was uh, getting oh, ready getting to go to work. On. But Aw, with Owen. Yeah. Aw. That's Owen. Yes, I know. Cute. I, I said to Kim, why would you take that picture, let alone post it? And she said, because that right there, that's Kim's spot. Uh -oh. She's like, she I can't said. even sleep with you. Owen right has taken her big spot. old hoof right in the middle of her spot. <laughs> Nonetheless, if you want more pictures oh, of me and man. Owen, in bed, Facebook.com slash the cars are. I'll answer your automotive questions. I love you, man. That's how oh, really Owen. ridiculous my life's become. Back to you. Oh, That's a Owen. good looking Weimar. All right. Back to you. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Doug. All right. If you want to enjoy.